There was once a senior monk from Bangkok who went to see a John Mun. The teacher of the senior monk had been a friend of a John Mun's, would often take this monk when he was younger to see a John Mun. But the monk from Bangkok was never impressed. He kept thinking, what do these monks know? Out alone in the forest with their eyes closed, what can they know? Here I am reading Dharma books in the city with my eyes wide open. There are a lot of things I don't understand. So one time after his teacher died, he went to see a John Mun and asked him, he said, when I'm in the city, surrounded by all these wise people who study the Dharma, even then there are times when I have doubts about it. But you out here in the, in the forest, where do you get to hear the Dharma? And the John Mun said, I hear the Dharma 24 hours a day. A leaf falls, a bird calls, there's Dharma right there. The old monk was taken aback and said, well, it's a sign that you know how to listen. Because the Dharma is everywhere, it's showing itself all the time. Things are changing. When an animal calls, it's usually called calling out of suffering. We're surrounded by these things, and yet we ignore them. So even though the Dharma is displaying itself proclaiming itself all the time. We don't hear it. It's like a radio station that's broadcasting all the time, but we're tuned into other frequencies. We're tuned into our greed, we're tuned into our aversion, we're tuned into our delusion. Everywhere we go, that's what we hear, that's what we see. So learn how to tune your radio to the Buddhist channel. The Dharma channel. The Dharma is always being proclaimed. The things that excite lust, things that excite desire, when you're tuned into the right channel, you begin to realize they're not worth it. The things that incite anger, they're not worth it. The treasures of the world, they're not worth it. What's worth it? The treasures that you develop in your own mind. Because you're looking for happiness outside, you're looking in the wrong place, you have to look inside. That's the message of the Dharma. So keep referring things inside. Tune into the Buddha's channel, and you'll get to hear the Dharma all the time.